spectacular hummingbirds. Birds, bats, bees and other insects are all important, but hummingbirds seem to do the job with the most flair. They have that vibrant coloration, their rapier-like bills perfectly adapted to each species flowery food source, their adorably tiny size, and of course their jaw-dropping flying abilities. There are about 338 different species of hummingbirds, an amazing family of birds found only in the new world. Their ability to hover for extended periods of time, and even fly backwards makes them unique in the bird world. What they lack in size, they make up for with energy, the pinnacle of this being the ruby-throated hummingbird's incredible ability to flap up to 200 times per second during courtship displays. Though tiny, male hummingbirds are among the most flashy birds in the world, often sporting an array of iridescent feathers used to attract mates. Found from Alaska to the very tip of South America, from the rainforest, to the hot, dry desert, to the bone-chilling heights of the Andes, there are very few places where these adaptable birds can't survive. Amazing Facts About the Hummingbird There are 320 different species of hummingbird found throughout the Americas. The smallest of all is the tiny bee hummingbird, Melishuga heleni. They are among the smallest of birds. Their English name derives from the characteristic hum made by their rapid wing beats. Each species of hummingbird makes a different humming sound, determined by the number of wing beats per second. They can hover in mid-air by rapidly flapping their wings 12 to 90 times per second, depending on the species. During courtship, the wingtips of the ruby-throated hummingbird beat up to 200 times per second, as opposed to the usual wing beat of 90 times per second. When the female appears, her partner displays by flying to and fro in a perfect arc. The pair then dives up and down vertically, facing each other. Male hummingbirds are reported to have achieved speeds of almost 400 body lengths per second when swooping in an effort to impress females. They have feet so tiny that they cannot walk on the ground, and find it awkward to shuffle along a perch. They have a short, high-pitched squeaky call. Some are so small, they have been known to be caught by dragonflies and praying mantis, trapped in spiders' webs, snatched by frogs and stuck on thistles. The hummingbird needs to eat twice its body weight in food every day, and to do so they must visit hundreds of flowers daily. Hummingbirds eat nectar for the most part, although they may catch an insect now and then for a protein boost. They can fly backwards and are the only group of birds able to do so. They can fly at speeds exceeding 15 meters per second or 54 kilometers per hour. Their super-fast wing beats use up a lot of energy, so they spend most of the day sitting around resting. To save energy at night, many species go into torpor, a short-term decrease in body temperature and metabolic rate. Despite their tiny size, the ruby-throated hummingbird makes a remarkable annual migration, flying over 3,000 kilometers from the eastern USA, crossing over 1,000 kilometers of the Gulf of Mexico, in a single journey to winter in Central America. The ruby-throated hummingbird has only approximately 940 feathers on its entire body. Before migrating, the hummingbird stores a layer of fat equal to half its body weight. The female hummingbird builds a tiny nest high up in a tree, often up to 6 meters from the ground. She coats the outside with lichen and small pieces of bark and lines the inside with plant material. The male takes no responsibility in rearing the young and may find another mate after the first brood hatches. Some species of hummingbird are so rare that they have been identified only from the skins exported to Europe. Here are 10 of the most spectacular hummingbirds in the world. 10. Velvet Purple Coronet This stunner boasts a brilliant array of unique iridescent color. 
It can be found in the western foothills of the Andes, in Colombia and northern Ecuador. These birds are found along the western half of the U.S. ranging from Alaska all the way south to Mexico depending on the season and their migration. Their orange color can be spotted in flowers and at backyard feeders, but only for a short time as this bird is usually on the move. They are known as hummingbirds because of the humming sound created by their beating wings, which flap at high frequencies audible to humans. They hover in midair at rapid wing flapping rates, which vary from around 12 beats per second in the largest species, to in excess of 80 in some of the smallest. Of those species that have been measured in wind tunnels, their top speeds exceed 15 meters per second, 54 kilometers per hour, 34 miles per hour, and some species can dive at speeds in excess of 22 meters per second, 79 kilometers per hour, 49 miles per hour. Hummingbirds have the highest mass-specific metabolic rate of any homeothermic animal. To conserve energy when food is scarce, and nightly when not foraging, they can go into torpor, a state similar to hibernation, slowing their metabolic rate to one-fifteenth of its normal rate. 9. Black-tailed train bearer the impressive tail of the male black-tailed train bear is among the longest in the world of birds. During aggressive territorial displays, a loud crackling sound is produced as the tail feathers collide. Ranging from Colombia to southern Peru, this species is very hardy, capable of surviving the harsh, high elevation climate of the Andes. 8. Rainbow Bearded Thornbill Sporting an incredibly colorful gorget, this hummingbird inhabits the high elevation Paramo grasslands of the northern Andes in Colombia, Ecuador, and Peru. 7. Sword-billed hummingbird The sword-billed hummingbird has the longest bill of any bird. Found throughout the cloud forest of the Andes, from Venezuela to Bolivia, this species has co-evolved with several species of long, tubular flowers. Due to its extreme bill size, it monopolizes these flowers, having nearly exclusive access to its nectar. To return the favor, the sword bill acts as a very effective pollinator, symbiosis at its finest. 6. Booted Racket Tail Hummingbird the male of this species has a pair of impressive tail feathers. The feathers extend well past his body and end in two iridescent racket-like flares. Many native flowering plants rely on this hummingbird species for pollination, since they can reach into the long tubular flowers that exclude bees or butterflies from access. 5. Long-tailed sylph The spectacularly long, Iridescent tail of male long-tailed sylphs is truly an unbelievable sight. Found throughout the cloud forests of the northern Andes, where they zip through the dense foliage, glittering streamers in tow. Photograph this species on our Ecuador Photo Workshop. 4. Ecuadorian Hill Star Found at elevations upwards of 5,200 meters or 17,000 feet in the northern Andes, this species' ability to withstand freezing temperatures and thin air is impressive to say the least. They feed nearly exclusively on the orange flowers of Chukiraga plants that grow on the slopes of volcanic peaks. 3. Anna's Hummingbird The northernmost year-round resident hummingbird Anna's hummingbirds regularly winter as far north as southeast Alaska. During cold winter nights, they must go into a controlled state of hypothermia known as torpor, when their metabolic rate drops by an astounding 95%. Their internal body clock wakes them about two hours before dawn and they slowly begin to shiver, eventually raising their body temperature back up to 40 degrees Celsius. 2. Marvelous Spatial Tail The remarkable racket-shaped appendages of male marvelous spatial tails are used in courtship displays and can even be moved independently. 
they are found only in a tiny region of northern Peru. Because of habitat loss and their small distribution, they're listed as endangered on the Yukon Red List. 1. Fiery-throated hummingbird There are few other birds that rival the spectacular iridescence of the fiery-throated hummingbird. Found only in the cloud forests of Costa Rica and western Panama, for bird lovers, this bird alone warrants a trip to Central America. Thanks for watching. Drop a like. Leave a comment on what would you like to see next. And don't forget to subscribe. Animal Facts 101